Last week, the Minutemen lost to FIU 44-0. This week, they travel to take on the LA Bulldogs in Louisiana. There's no such thing as close when you get beat 44-0. to um, You know, and so the, we understand we've got a lot of improving to do. We've got a lot of, you know, we got a lot of recruiting to do. We've got a lot of investing in our young people to do. We've got a lot of coaching to do. And, uh, but uh, no, obviously. Head coach Walt Bell and QB Michael Curtis both talked about their plans for the run game this week. Uh, same, you know, having played those guys, you know, played them in a bowl game uh, when Coach Holtz was there. You know, having played them a few times at Southern Miss. I mean, it, it's very typical of a lot tech football team. Gritty, tough, large. Um, you know, filled with a lot of kids, you know, from a lot of really tough, hard places where football is really important and it shows in the way they play. You know. More of all this week. <laughs> Just Bro goes back to the Bro same. Broken record goes back to the same thing. You know, having our hats in the right place, our hands in the right place, great bases, great first. Yeah, alignment assignment first step. And, and again, I don't want to sound like a broken record, but that's the truth. That's where we got to be better. You know, no matter, no matter what looks to give us different things, as long as we can, you know, when we line up on our different run plays, we execute them, each person to the best of their ability, we should be fine no matter. You know, if I'm running the ball, if people always run the ball, Cameron the ball, or, you know, somebody else is running the ball. LA Tech will look to get their fifth win of the season versus the Minutemen, who will be looking to get their second. In Amherst, I'm Liam Shea, Amherst Wire Sports.